Hey, yo, check it out. This is Mr. Cab Cabernet, lifestyle connoisseur. And uh, this is a quick message for all the princes out there, all the kings and all the kings in training. And I wanna ask you a question. Who is the most important person in your life? Think about that. These are confessions of a lifestyle connoisseur. 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 I'm pretty sure you never felt this kind of. So, who is the most important person in your life, King? Is it your mother, your father? Is it your sister, your brother? Is it your girl, your wife, even your child, your children? Who's the most important person in your life? No, 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 and no. The most important person in your life, young king, is you. Now, I know we've been taught to the contrary. You know, um, this one's more important. You know, put your lady up on the pedestal. She's more important than you. You know, um, put your mother up on the pedestal. She's more important than you. Your, your 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 younger siblings are more important. Your even your children are more important. But the reality is, if you're not taking care of yourself, and when I say self, I mean physical self, your your physical health, the mental self, the mental health, your spiritual self, your your spiritual health. your emotional self, your emotional health, then you can't do a damn thing for any of them people in your life. We have to take care of ourselves because as men, we have a lot more pressure as soon as we walk out the door, the world is against us, okay? We have so many obstacles, so many obstacles to navigate in order to be successful in whatever we're doing, just to survive. Even if you're not trying to be successful at something, just to be successful at living you know what I'm saying? You see, men, we are the builders. Okay, we build the buildings. We build the train tracks, the airplanes, the sewer system, the, uh, just everything that makes this, this, this world run. We build that shit. We are the problem solvers and the fixers. So it's very important for us to be physically, mentally, emotionally, spiritually healthy for us to even do these jobs. Think about any, any man who's, who's ever built something of importance in this world, okay? This man had to focus on himself. He had to zoom in and focus on himself and his ideas and, and, and put together the plan and the discipline to actually execute these ideas. He had to be right in his mind and he had to be well, you know, he, 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 you can't be sick and, and, and be able to, to function properly. We gotta take care of ourselves, focus on ourselves. Because nobody gives a shit about men. Men don't even give a shit about men. You see what I'm saying? You gotta give a shit about yourself. And 
just make sure your your plan includes taking care of your loved ones. You got children, make sure whatever you're doing is setting up their future, okay? Yeah, they're gonna miss you, you're gonna miss them. But the, it's about quality over quantity time. It's not about being there all the time. We have to make ourselves the priority. So if you have a purpose, that purpose needs to be your priority. You need to focus on that purpose. And if you focus on that purpose and be the best man you can be to the best of your ability, right? The best version of yourself. You will get the results that you want and you and, and everybody else in your life of importance will benefit from you making yourself the most important person in your life. And again, even if you have children, your children don't come before your importance because you can't take care of them or provide for them a future if you are not okay. See, fathers don't have to be around all the time. That's a falsehood. That's not what makes a father a good father. A father is supposed to be out hunting. He's supposed to be out uh, making a living and providing. Okay? But not just money. He's supposed to be providing provision. He's supposed to be providing the, the, uh, the assets that allow him to protect and guide his children and his family. He doesn't have to be around all the time, okay? The mother is supposed to be around more than the father because she's the nurturer of the children. A man's purpose is him moving in his purpose. A woman's purpose is supposed to be supporting her man in his purpose. And then the children report to the mother. The man reports to the creator, the most high. And that's the structure. I understand in today's day and age, that shit is all out of whack, but that's nature. So we ain't gonna talk about what's going on and all these different types of situationships and different structures of, you know, failed structures of relationships and families. We're going to talk about what it's supposed to be. And this is the way it works. I promise you, if, if you focus on yourself, young man, and do what you're supposed to do, zoom in, focus. Listen, whatever you got to do, do what you got to do. Make it clear that this purpose is going to benefit all of you. Just support my purpose. Focus on you. This is Mr. Cab Cabernet, Lifestyle Connoisseur, and these are confessions of a lifestyle connoisseur. 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 I'm pretty sure you never felt this kind of